down on, basically showing all the lies in the mainstream media. Like in the UK, here's the UK health minister, I believe. Minister, it's a religion, it's a cult, it's actually a death cult. Talking about how 10,000 people die every month in uh, senior homes anyway, and then he goes on to talk about, again, of course, a super sad, tragic case, guys. A 13-year-old kid has died from the certi Certificate of Vaccination ID. There's just one problem. This is the same kid they've been using <laughs> numerous times. It might even be dozens now. Who's apparently has got the worst luck ever. He's died. He dies all the time in various different countries. There's one other thing and one other change I want to make, which is giving people the right to say goodbye. One of the important things that care homes do is support people at the end of their life. Sadly, even in normal times, each month, about 10,000 people die in care homes. As a father of a 13-year-old myself, the reports of Ishmael dying aged 13 without a parent at his bedside made me weep. And the sight of his coffin being lowered into a grave without a member of his family present was too awful. The reports of Ishmael dying aged 13. So basically everything you're seeing on the mainstream media, which you should not be watching, I've been saying this for years. <laughs> Some people still do, it's amazing. And it's basically a form of magic. And just like the 2012 Olympic opening ceremonies, that was also a ritual, a basically a satanic ritual that they used to begin to uh, do their spell. And you might notice everyone talks about this stuff like it's a spell. Uh, Donald Trump has said this horrible, horrible spell. In this horrible period, this horrible, dark period where this, this monster came and, and uh, worked its horrible, horrible spell over the world. And even this, uh, I guess he's some sort of um, criminal in New York, name of Cuomo, I don't know who he is, but he's been lying and lying about everything for quite a while here. Even saying how they're burying bodies on Heart Island, like they've been doing for the last hundred years and nothing's changed. But he doesn't use the word spell, he used the word beast all, the, all over the place. The headline is, the beast can rise up again if the economy is open too quickly. And he goes on to say, we can control the beast Yes, but the beast is still alive. We did not kill the beast, and the beast can rise up again. Very much like what they tell children in little horror stories, right? Or even in the uh, 2012 Olympics, they had this beast rise up with what looks like a needle in its hand, sp spurting out vaccines. Thank you. 
and even Bill Gates.